It's time for some non-MLBB content. Here's my everyday carry. We're the Darkly Studios headquarters, and if I'm not on an MPLPH desk casting MLBB sports, I'm right here. So with that said, here's the stuff that I usually carry on my person. All right, we'll start with this one. This is the ROG Phone 6D in the M5 Special Edition case. So this is what I would call my gaming phone. I have, in the past couple of years, drawn the line between what my work phone is and my personal phone is, my gaming phone. And this is the gaming phone. So I play MLBB, all my other esports on this and I scroll and watch YouTube on this uh, just as much as my other phone because of the big and nice screen. So that's the ROG Phone 6D, M5 edition. The other piece that I carry is an iPhone, oh, it's Castle, and that's Cups, uh, an iPhone 14 Pro Max. It's just the simplicity of uh, everything. It's just the Apple ecosystem that I'm currently part of. Again, iPad, AirPods, CarPlay, all that. And it's just so hard to leave. So I've been in the Apple ecosystem for the past three years now, starting in 2021 when I got my iPhone 12 Pro uh, when I was still coaching with uh, work slash TNC. And I never looked back since. So this is the everyday slash work phone. It's the ROG and the iPhone. Uh, talking about work, how do I get to work? Well, these are my car keys. Uh, looking at the different pieces on it, number one is a carabiner, uh, which is rated for 25 pounds, 11 kilos. Uh, not that I would put anything on it that weighs close to that. Uh, main key itself, uh, drive a Ford, uh, car lock remote, uh, anytime fitness uh, key fob. So. Gotta stay in shape, gotta be able to fit my suits. And uh, an all-in-one tool. Uh, it's got multiple uh, parts to it. It's got serrations, uh, able to open uh, cans with this. Uh, this is a screwdriver, so I can hit that. A file here, and it's all on this cool little key-shaped thing. Uh, never really too sharp to, to, to harm anyone, so this is okay to fit on my, uh, on me and my person and in my pockets. But yeah, this is just goes on the belt, usually. Okay. The other side of my uh, pant loop carries AirPods. Uh, AirPods Pro Gen 2, if I'm not mistaken. Just seamless. Need to take a call, pow, hello. Need to take a meeting, open up the iPad, pow. Uh, working on content, uh, someone sends me an edit of a video, someone sends me anything that I need to watch, Does it, I don't want the others around the room to hear, pow! AirPods, just super duper uh, convenient. And of course, my wallet, all of the identification needed. Uh, this is a Secred. I'm not so sure what the uh, exact nomenclature on this is, we'll put it on this video. But yeah, it's one of those pop-up wallets that can carry some cash. And yeah, it's, it's uh, been with me since 2017. So it's now a seven-year-old wallet. It still looks great. Mm. Uh, of course, my Darkly Studios ID. So that's the RFID on that. And last but not least, can't leave the house without my Apple Watch. I believe this is a Series 8 45 millimeter. Uh, it tracks my steps, uh, gives me notifications, allows for me to put a world clock on it. So if I was talking to someone halfway across the world in Indonesia or that time zone again when they're minus one, uh, remind me of certain things, control my media if I don't want to like, you know, touch other things. If I'm moving around the house, moving around the office, the watch checks it. Also keeps me accountable for my workouts because I will always be staring at them circles and seeing that I did not fill in my workout quota, my standing quota, my steps quota. So I'll remember. Uh, that aside, I think that's all. <gasps> We're at work now. How do I get in the house? And my house keys. Simple, it's just one key, main lock. 
and of course, a keychain of the baby guy. That's my everyday carry. Let me know what else you want to see. My main bag, what's in my car, what my desk setup is like. Put in the comments below. Hope you all have a great day.